Though they've played in the last four state tournaments, there is not a lot of metro-wide hype for the Maple Grove boys basketball team this winter. As Jay Wilcox reports, that's okay with the Crimson. The wins keep piling up for the Maple Grove boys basketball team. The Crimson enter this week with a 9-2 record, due in large part to consistent effort on defense. Yeah, I would say that's definitely the uh, main key of our team is we play defense and that's kind of how we create offense. And I mean, that's been our kind of goal all year is to be one of the top five defensive teams in the state. We're going to keep working at that all year. Our identity is, is to guard and play defense first. And uh, these guys have really taken ownership in that. And, and, and it's a big deal for them to, to hold people under 60 points. Maple Grove's only stumbles came on back-to-back -back days at the Granite City Classic at the end of December. They chalked those losses up as learning experiences. Yeah, we learned from it. We were up, we were up uh, and over time, we have to learn to just keep our composure and work. Yeah, not so much refocus, but I think just to, sh just to show things that we weren't doing well. Um, we weren't finishing games well. We were, you know, some, some small things on our, on our defensive end, some small things on our offensive end, so we could show these guys and say, hey, this is what we're doing. You know, losing two in a row is never a great thing, but um, you know, everything's a learning experience. If you look at it that way, it's a positive. The tougher part of the schedule is still to come, and rivalry games like Champlain Park and Osseo are just ahead. Yeah, we look forward to those every year because those are the big teams we want to play and get, uh, win against. Exactly, yeah. I think that would be really fun because it kind of gives us a perspective about where we are too compared to the rest of the team. So it'll just give us be a good benchmark to find out where we are. As in the past couple of seasons, Maple Grove seems to be flying under the radar without a lot of hype. It doesn't exactly bother Crimson coach Nick Schroeder. Uh, I love uh, I love when people write write about everybody except us. I love when we're not we're never in the top ten or the top. I love it. Um, it it's outstanding. It, it, it's it's just an extra thing to uh, distract, um, and we're we're focused on what we need to do and what we need to do to get better. And and uh, that's 100% okay with me. There may be no superstars here, but a lot of good players have Maple Grove eyeing a fifth consecutive trip to state. Jay Wilcox, CCX Sports. Maple Grove will get tested this week as they host Champlain Park Wednesday and Tutino Grace Friday. Their game at Centennial that was postponed this past Friday has been rescheduled for this coming Monday. Find more prep sports games and highlights at ccxmedia.org and follow us on social media.